Hang on to these cards. They become gold, and you need to bring them back for the second dose. No worries about that. Kansas City EMT Paul Milano plans to keep that card in a safe spot. He says with the nature of his job, avoiding COVID becomes a top priority. You know, it's tough to do because we're everyone's so close. Others, like Sean Byrne, feel the way most of us do. I'm hoping it works. I know what the EMS uh, folks do and what they encounter, and so they're very much frontline with our patients. Truman Medical Center vaccinating 200 area EMTs on Friday and another 400 next week. And anything we can do to kind of increase our survivability on a day in and day out basis is, uh, is a good thing for us. Doctors here say it's been a long battle with COVID and it will continue to be one, but they say having a chance to vaccinate EMTs on this day was pretty special. And obviously, these these uh, paramedics and EMTs uh, right on the front line. It's really important that we get them protected. Just trying to do my part, uh, get vaccinated uh, to protect myself and my family and the community that we serve. In Kansas City, Alan Schoep, KNBC 9 News.